this question asks us to plot the velocity versus position graph. To do that, let's first write down the equations for the segments of the graph, between 0 and 200 meters, and 200 to 400 meters. The first section can be represented using the equation a equals 2 over 200 s, which is simply 1 over 100 s. The second segment is a equals 2. Now we need a relationship between velocity, acceleration, and position. We know of one, which is ADS is equal to VDV. Let's write it the opposite way. VDV is equal to ADS. We can take the integral of this equation to find the velocity. Since the train starts with a velocity of 0 meters per second and a displacement value of 0 meters, those will be our lower bounds. Solving this integral and isolating for V by taking the square root of both sides gives us S over 10. Now we need to figure out the velocity at 200 meters so that we can use it as the lower bounds for the next integral. Substituting 200 gives us a velocity value of 20 meters per second. In other words, at the point the train crosses the 200 meter mark, it's traveling at a speed of 20 meters per second. Those are our lower bounds for the next integral. Solving this integral and isolating for velocity gives us our velocity equation for the next segment. Let's calculate the velocity of the train at 400 meters to make it easier for us to draw the graph. Substituting 400 meters gives us a velocity of 34.64 meters per second. The graph looks like this. If you have any questions or if there are ways to improve these videos, please let us know. Thanks for watching, and if this helped you, please give us a like.